Let's imagine that we hooked up a capacitor to a battery and the capacitor has a dielectric inside of it. So we've charged up this capacitor to have some charge capital Q on one plate and minus Q on the other plate. Now we disconnect the capacitor from the battery and the charge remains. We've stored some energy in the system. What happens to that energy if we try to yank the dielectric out of the capacitor? Will it be greater, less, or the same? We have to remember that the potential energy stored in a capacitor is one-half CV squared. But that's a co somewhat complicated formula to use because we know that when we pull the, the dielectric out of the capacitor, the voltage will change and the capacitance will change. It's actually to our advantage to use the second expression for potential energy stored, which is Q squared over 2C. Because in this case, once we've disconnected the battery from the capacitor, the charge will remain constant. There's always that amount of charge sitting on the surface of the capacitor plates. Now, when we look at this problem, we know that the charge will be constant in the numerator of the potential energy expression. And we can remember that it's only the capacitance that's changing. While formerly we used to have a capacitance C, to, which is equal to kappa times some C naught, after we pull the, the dielectric out, we'll just have C naught. In other words, the capacitance will drop by some factor kappa. We also know that the voltage will increase when we pull out that, that dielectric by so that same factor kappa. When we think about what will happen to the potential energy, the potential energy will increase because the capacitance actually decreased. It may make no sense to you that the potential energy would actually increase by pulling this thing out, but it's actually important to remember that you will have to do some amount of work to pull the dielectric out of the plates of the capacitor. It's been, in some sense, charged up and is attracted back to the plates. By trying to pull it out, you'll be working up against a force, the force, the electrostatic force of attraction between the plates and the dielectric. Because you're having to work against that force, you will have to add work to the system. And that work that you add manifests itself as an increase in voltage, or also an increase in potential energy stored in the capacitor.